connects the coolest fans to hot celebrities. Brought to you by JW Marriott. Happy Hour with Kenji Knox featuring Kenji Swirl. I am so honored. I'm sitting next to my homegirl. I grew up with the history and legacy of her father, who is a doctor. Watched her beauty on TV. Watched her work with Martin Lawrence. Do you feel who I'm talking about? I'm talking about Miss Lynn Whitfield. You got to bow down when you do this. How are you doing? I'm doing great, thank you. Oh my God. Give us beauty tips when you look at you. It's like model. <laughs> Diva. Really? But yes, what oh. tips? I'm like, God. I think it's important to. You love what you love. I hate them like beautiful. beautiful, beautiful. Uh, 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 you want you mad? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I think it's important to be authentic, be who you are. You don't necessarily have to do what's the latest and the greatest, but find out what looks beautiful on you, um, and pay attention to the details. You know, look at everything from all different angles in that mirror. When, you, when you're acting, that's what people are getting. Your beauty. Style. You walk with your elegance, the way you carry your words, your style, your looks. You do that. Well, I don't know. I guess it's all a part of me, and it depends on the it depends on the role that I'm playing. If if that is important, you know, sometimes that's not there. Sometimes there are people who don't pay any attention to that. So in acting, it can be different. The Lady May on Greenleaf is one of those women. Um, Brandy Webb on Thin Line Between Love and Hate, she yes. was one of those women. Sometimes people with a lot of problems cover it up really well by looking great, wow. by making the package so great, the but there's all sorts of things going on inside you. Wow. And so, um, yeah, so uh, many times when I'm Pulling a character together, it's not just about, oh yeah, I want the cute outfit, but it's about what that person would wear and how they would do it and what that means to them. You just exude that strength, even with that TV One series you did with the, um, the murder. Yeah, case. that was my voice. Yeah, your voice, it would be great. It was just so powerful that it was haunting to oh. me. <laughs> and that you haunted me. I'm like, oh. <laughs> So you can exude it so many different ways. So being from Baton Rouge, Oh, shout out to Baton Rouge. My mother is still in Baton Rouge. All of my siblings are in Baton Rouge. I wouldn't be me if I had not been raised by, first of all, shout out to the state. Uh, Louisiana. Uh, uh, Louisiana, but Baton Rouge and all of the people who influenced my life there has been was so important. You know, with my father having the Baton Rouge Community Chorus and my grandfather being a um, being a family doctor there, yes. old country family doctor. I mean, my root, I did not leave Baton Rouge until I went to college. So I talk about Baton Rouge. I am Baton Rouge. Yeah, Baton it Rouge. is. The red stack. It is. <laughs> and, it, you know, I carry it inside me always, you know. Thank you, Len Winfield, for hanging out with the Grange fan. We appreciate you, but I gotta ask you a quick question. Who are you here to see at Essence Festival? Oh, you know what? I have been working so much. I haven't. <laughs> I but um, uh, I want to see. see well, I want to really right now. I want to see everybody. I want to see Mariah Carey. I want to see everybody. I want to see the tribute to Prince. I know because I'm hot. still. Weird. Mourning and yeah. celebrating him and wanting everybody to, his spirit to be on everybody's heart. Yeah, and so I can't wait to, too. oh, thank you. You know, when you, when you represent, every time we pass by that street on um, Washington, Washington Street, we hear the story about the Mike Fields. So you represent our legacy. Well, it was the Smiths and the Butlers. The Butlers. Down yes, there. The butlers and then, yeah, yeah, yeah. Butlers. yes, 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 yes. Yeah. <laughs> The Smiths and the Butlers down there, and then that was my married name, Whitfield, and so I kept it because everybody by then everybody knew right? Lynn Whitfield. Yeah. Yes, yes. Oh, that's Leo all Butler right. Yes. yes. Thank you for bringing me back. Correctly. You're welcome. Jack, mate, that's what school is all about. <laughs> Get you guys with the greatest man. Thank you so much.